children, you can do it. And part of you is scared that you might not live through it. You know you really haven't got a choice. So tell yourself that you can make it. All you have to do is take it one minute to the next. I think what the Admiral is trying to say is that there are new laws here in Hungary, and we mustn't try and get around them. Colonel Eichmann, Mr. Wallenberg. It's an honor, sir. It's not every day I get a bottle of champagne from a member of such a prominent family. It's not every day I get to send one to such a notorious member of the Nazi party. <laughs> <laughs> well, now, since your business with the Regent is done, why don't we leave him to enjoy his brandy, Admiral? Please, give my best to His Majesty. Yes, of course, sir. So, Mr. Wallenberg, you're here to save the Jews. Ah, I see you've done your research. I have my resources. Well, how about it, Colonel? What will it take for you and your men to leave the Jews here in Budapest alone? Two million? Three? You should do your research. Just a few months ago, I was offered twice that amount for the Jews of Slovakia, and I turned it down. Times have changed. Germany doesn't hold quite the same position it did a few months ago. I'm offering you an easy solution for your Jewish problem. Mr. Wallenberg, there is only one solution for the Jewish problem. The final one. But thank you for the champagne. It was quite good. I'm not about to give up, you know. You do what you must. But I'd be careful if I were you. Budapest is a dangerous city these days. Come, take my arm. Anna Mu 
Mueller. Susan Bauer. You're hurt. Captain Schuler. we have a problem here. Clearly your men did not check everyone's papers. Look at this ship's pass. Sir, I have strict orders to remove everyone from the Southwest. You are clearly in violation of international law. If someone has one of these, you let them know. Do you understand? Do you understand, soldier? Yes, sir! into your custody. I'll go around back. Give me some more. This train will be leaving in six minutes, and I'm authorized to shoot anyone who interferes. Put that gun down, soldier. You don't want to be held responsible for a mistake of this proportion. Pass them down. Young ones first. I have my orders. I'd like to see those orders, Captain. You show me exactly where it says that you have the right to deport citizens of a neutral country on this transport. My superior officer briefed us this morning, and this I... This is an outrage! Are you familiar with Section 168B of Article 4 of the Geneva Convention? Mr. Oliver! Some of the people on this car have shoots passes! Soldier? All right, you've got two minutes! Anyone with a shoots pass, come forward at once! Hurry now! Oh. 
cheeks will blue Yes, the lilacs will blue spent the night putting cigarettes out on my arm? Is it rational that I went out to get a loaf of bread and came home to find that my wife had been taken? I'm sorry. You should be! You got here too late, Rao! She was the one worth saving. <laughs> this hat, this silly hat, and it had feathers sticking out from the side, yellow feathers sticking out from the side, and it just didn't fit her well. It was two sizes too big, as far as I could tell, but it looked beautiful somehow. She couldn't cook, not even eggs. It was pathetic what she'd do to a steak. And my God, when she attempted to bake. Still again and again she tried. And we would taste it and laugh about it.
like you. Wallenberg, my family had no name. Nothing was ever just handed to me. I always had to play the game. I know you think I have some deep-rooted hatred for the Jews. But here's a startling little bit of news. I have nothing against them, really. They're just a means to an end. Just trying to live life at the top, my friend. I do my job. It's very simple. I try to be as thorough and exacting as I can and when I'm finished, completely finished. History will show Hitler chose the best plan. They may hang me in the end to the delight of everyone, but I shall perish throughout me. win, Wallenberg. Surely by now you must know that. You speak as if it's a competition, Colonel. Isn't it? 70,000 people think what the world will say. 70,000 lives someone will be forced to pay. The war crimes tribunal will be looking for a name.